It's the OCG Fam Show, and we're answering a viewer question. Why do I need microbial products? And if I need them, why don't you just mix them in with my nutrients? What's the deal? Hey there! Bob from Organs Constant Gardener, welcome to the OCG Fam Show to you, my YouTube buddies. What's going on? Let me know in the comments, and we'll talk about it down there in the comments. Speaking of the comments, cool name, uh, ask a question. He's asked quite a few questions. We really appreciate you participating in the show, supporting the show. Uh, all the rest of you as well, but he asked a question that we answered in the viewer comments uh, a couple of viewer comments ago But it was deep into the episode and I thought it was an important topic So I wanted to bring it up and show you a little bit of what Scott said about it But let's just uh, let's talk about it a little bit before we do that what he said was hey All these nutrient companies not just nectar for the guys, but all these nutrient companies Recommend using a compost tea or some sort of microbial product SLF 100 micro life culture teas that kind of stuff but they say we have a complete nutrient line, it's the whole thing, it's available to the plant. If you need the microbials, why don't you just put the microbials in with it? And furthermore, why do you need microbials if you've got this thing that works? So I wanted to address this in two parts. The first part is, why can't you just put microbials in with the product? So watch this with Scott and I'll talk to you in just a minute. I am confused a little. Why do compost teas get recommended with almost all newt lines when every manufacturer always say their newt line is the best, most complete, all you need for a massive perfect harvest? This is not to rip anyone or their products. Mm -hmm. Sounds like a little yeah. Just wondering why this stuff isn't in the, the teas isn't incorporated in the nutrient line instead of having it be almost a second thought and having to get separate and guess what's better product from each manufacturer's line. And that's a good question, a good statement. And the reality is if I put the same bacteria that's in SLF or the same microbes that are in Easy Teas and I put them into the Herculean, that bottle would explode. It's literally adding gunfire, gunpowder to the fire. Yeah. Because the whole point of these bottles is that they are stable, they're neutral, and they are, you know, preserved. Yeah. And then you have life. Well, the life gets into these things and they activate it, it becomes a problem. It starts forming CO2, it starts breaking it down more, and then you get the gas off. Okay, so fair enough. You can't put the two together in the bottle or it's going to blow up. Yeah, it's going to expand up. It's not going to blow up. But that being said, if this stuff is complete nutrition, why do you need the microbials? And, uh, you know, we've talked a lot in the past about that, well, you know, you use the, the nectar for the gods, all the nutrient line. And the stuff goes into the soil, the plant takes what it needs, and the rest just kind of gets left there. And that if you use those microbials or the teas, that kind of thing, it's going to reinvigorate that stuff. It's going to make it available to plant again. It's going to take that back up, and you're not going to waste anything. But there's really a lot more to it with the microbials. And Scott went a little deeper into it here. And so uh, watch a little bit more, and we'll talk to you after. Microbes are so beneficial to plants mm -hmm. with or without nutrition. They keep them safe, they keep them healthy, they fight pathogens, disease. They're in there actually protecting your plant from no matter what your nutrition program is. So most manufacturers are gonna recommend some form of compost yeah. tea or some type of microbe to just help your plants be strong. And I mean, like the natural environment outdoors, we're trying to keep the plant healthy and strong. So we give it nature's little soldiers to protect it. Okay. So, you can't mix them in with it. They're important to have. Why doesn't Nectar for the Gods make a microbial product? Good question. Keep watching. So, I know the answer, I think. It's not your bag. And you're a specialist in what you do, but why don't you just make a, a microbial? Well, because we're not the creator of the microbe. So, a lot yeah. of guys have done that. I mean, a lot of people are just buying spores and then making their own products. There's a few companies that are actually colonizing their own spores. Uh -huh. Those are the people we try to do more business yeah, with. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, and so what we see is the guys that are colonizing and controlling that market, they're the ones that are doing great. Yeah. Everybody else is just buying spores from these markets, creating proprietary blends, and then putting them out there as so tea sources. Their right thing sources. is a special thing, just like your thing is a special thing, and they figured it out like you figured this yeah. out, or there's people that are just buying a bunch of that stuff and throwing it in a bucket. Or a box, or yeah, bag. yeah. So it's it's just it's 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 a thing to make. Yeah, that we stuff. don't want to be in the microbial world. Yeah. We have too many friends that are already yeah. there. They've done well. I don't believe in making money on other people's work. Mm -hmm. And you know, we we'd rather promote a community than promote dollars True. in our pockets, which is stupid. So there you go. I thought that might be an interesting thing for you. Was it an interesting thing for you? I I feel like maybe. 
Am I getting you the information you need? Is this working for you? What are we doing with this show? What do you want to do with this show? Uh, you know, I'm not having a you know uh, existential crisis or anything, but I'm wondering, what do you want? What can I do to make this better for you? How can I help you with your growth? How can I help you to grow better with nectar? Let me know down there. I love you. I'll see you tomorrow. The OCG Fam Show. It's pretty good. It happens every day. It's the OCG Fam Show. See you tomorrow. <laughs>